Hi everyone, it's Femi Alanio here and in this video, I'll be showing you the step-by-step -step guide on how you can send crypto to anyone around the world without charges and zero fees and also how you can receive crypto without charges using the Binance Pay. You can also use the Binance Pay to make online payments and if you are the kind of person that you sell things online, you can even use the Binance Pay to receive crypto payments from your customers. So in this video, I'll be showing you how you can do all of this. So make sure you watch this video to the end so you don't miss any important information. Now, before I go on, if you are new to my YouTube channel, welcome. My name is Femi Olanio and I make videos on personal finance, cryptocurrencies, the stock market and how to make money online. So if you love content like this, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel and please like this video so that more people can be able to see this video. Thank you. Now to the process of how you can send crypto to anyone around the world using the Binance Pay and without paying charges. The first thing you need to do after you've logged into your Binance account is to come and tap on your wallet. Now once you tap on your wallet, you tap on funding right here. Now once you're on your funding page, the next thing is to make sure that you have money in your funding wallet because you will need money before you can send crypto to anyone. And if you don't have crypto in your funding wallet and you're looking for how to get crypto, I have a video on how you can deposit and buy crypto on Binance via the P2P method. The link to that video will be in the description below. So kindly check it out if you want to learn how to buy crypto easily via P2P. But let's say you have money in your spot wallet but you don't have in your funding wallet. All you have to do is just transfer it from your spot wallet to your funding wallet. Now to transfer it, you come here to where you have transfer right here. Now you can see where you have from funding to sport. You are going to interchange them because you are transferring from sport to funding. So just tap on this icon right here. Once you tap on it, you change from sport to funding. And right here where the arrow is pointed to is where you put the crypto you want to transfer. So let's say it's USDT you want to send, you put USDT. If it's BTC, you put BTC. And right where you have amount, you enter the amount of that crypto that you want to transfer. So once you've done that, you will see the crypto in your funding wallet. Now, the next thing is to tap on pay where the arrow is pointed to. Once you tap on pay, it will take you to the Binance Pay page on the Binance app. Now, how can you now send crypto to anyone without paying charges? To send crypto, you tap on where you have sent right here. Now, the next thing to enter the person's details, the person you are sending to. So, it's either you ask for the person's email address. So, that's the email address the person has used to create his or her Binance account. So, you enter the person's email address right here. Or you ask for the person's phone number. That is the phone number the person is using for his or her Binance account. Or you ask for the person's pay ID. By the time you are creating your Binance Pay ID account, you will receive a Pay ID number. So that's the number you'll be putting here of that person, not your own. So the person you are sending to you receive the person's Pay ID and input it right here. Or you collect the person's Binance ID. So you can receive any of these four details from the person and send to the person. So let's for example, you want to use the person's Pay ID. So I'm going to use one of my friends' Pay ID right here. Once you tap on Pay ID, you enter the person's Pay ID right here. And then the next thing is to enter the amount of crypto you want to send so let's for example i want to send usdt to this person the next thing is to enter the amount of usdt you want to send so let's say for example you want to send 20 usdt you enter the amount and if that you want to add a note maybe for the person to see when the person has received the payment you can just type maybe payment for your um device or anything just put anything and then you tap on confirm and the next thing is to tap on continue at the bottom side of the screen. And right here, before you confirm the transaction, you are going to check out the details of the transaction. So you can see the note, payment for your device, payment method, funding wallet, that you are paying from your funding wallet. And the payment currency is 20 USDT. And then you tap on continue. And then the next thing is to enter your pay pin. So when you are creating your Binance Pay ID account, you also have to create a pay pin that you'll be using to confirm all your transactions. So once I input my pay pin right here, the transaction will be successful and this person will receive 20 USDT in his Binance account. So that is the simple way for you to send crypto to anyone on Binance without paying charges. So you are paying zero fees for this. Now, let's say for example, you want to receive crypto from someone. How do you do that? The next thing to tap on receive right here. Once you tap on receive, you'll be seeing this QR code that this person can scan to send you crypto or you can just send the person your pay ID. And another thing you can do is that you can add the amount the person wants to pay you. So let's say for example, um, you are charging someone, let's say 100 USDT for something. So instead of the person entering the amount is herself, you have to do it yourself or you can do it yourself. So you come here and tap on where you have add amount and then you can select the currency you want to add. So you, let's change it from 
uh, let's change it to USDT right here and then right here you enter the amount so let's say for example you want to receive 50 USDT from this person you select 50 USDT and tap on confirm so if the person should scan this QR code the person will be transferring 50 USDT to your Binance account or if you send this person your pay ID this person will be transferring 50 USDT to your Binance account so that's a simple way for you to send and receive crypto via your binance pay on the binance app without paying charges or zero fees now aside from sending and receiving crypto with the binance pay there are still other interesting things and interesting benefits that you can enjoy with the binance pay for example you can buy a time with the binance pay yes you can buy a time to your phone all you have to do is just tap on where you have mobile top up right here and once you tap on it, right here you enter the phone number you want to buy a time for. Now after you enter the phone number, you come here to where you have network provider and tap on the network provider you want to use. So you can see you have MTN Nigeria, Airtel Nigeria, Glow Mobile Nigeria, Nine Mobile Nigeria. So I select MTN Nigeria and then next thing is to enter the amount of a time you want to buy. So let's for example, I want to buy like 1000 Naira end time. So you scroll down to where you have 1000 Naira and then you can see where you have 1000 Naira. So you can see for 1000 Naira a time, you'll be spending 2.44 BUSD or 2.447 USDT. So whichever one you are using to pay. Then you tap on continue and then you enter your pay pin right here. So once you enter your pay pin, the a time will be transferred immediately to your SIM. So this is another thing you can enjoy using the Binance Pay. Now, not just that, there are still other things you can do with the Binance Pay. If you scroll down to where you have life on crypto, you see that you can use your Binance Pay account to buy gift cards around the world. You can use it to book hotels. You can use it to buy a lot of things on the internet let's say for example you want to use the coin gate so let's tap on coin gate right here now right here you'll be seeing the different services you can pay for with your binance pay account you can pay for vpn you can use it to book hotels you can use it to pay for your skype you can use it to pay for your favorite games you can see fortnite PUBG, mobile legends and so on you can use it to pay for different things on the internet you can even use it to do shopping on the internet so instead of you taking money around you can use cryptocurrencies to do all of these things on your phone so this is the simple way for you to use the binance pay to send and receive crypto and also to make payment online let me know if you've learned one or two things in this video and also if you have any question drop a question in the comment section of this video and if you want to learn how to withdraw your money to your bank account directly via the p2p method i have a video on that the link to that video will be in the description below make sure you check it out thanks for watching i'll see you guys in the next one bye